Okay, and before you translate out, can we uh, ask you to hit the uh, CETA brakes one more time? On my way back. Okay, I have a Richmond installed at the eyelid at uh, mile marker 7860. Copy that, mile marker 7860 for the Fairlays. A good look at the micrometeoroid orbital debris shield from Anne McLean's helmet camera. Okay, and we now have your WVS signal, and we still do not have dotted, but we're going to continue. Okay. And for you, Anne, can you verify that the MLI is covering the buckle on that second long duration tie down, and the wire tie is in place? Yes, to both, and I'm getting closed out photos for you in the whole area. Thanks a lot, Ann. McLean has remated the antenna uh, previously demated to access the work site and is taking some photos of the work site as she prepares to uh, move on to their next task. All right, I have the crew up bag. It is ready to my BRT and it's in my BRT. Copy that, Ann. All right, the panel's got to go. Is this two sides? I, it, it pulled right over it last time. It, it's a little tight, but it pulled, still it works. That's what I can do. There we go. Yep, there we go. Let's get. This juice is not bad here. And Anne, before you head out, could you give us a uh, glove and half check? Certainly. Glove, no change on the left, no change on the right, and a dry half. Copy, good, um, no change in gloves and good half. Okay, you're heading back to the airlock, uh, and you're going to spill that. Uh, Node 1 meter, crew lock bag on handrail 0550 near the width extender. So, Ann, it looks like you know where you're going. I think I do. I see the cable. Excellent. You can see uh, NASA astronaut Ann McLean has egressed the S, uh, S0 truss, and she's moving to the next portion of the truss, Bay 0, where she will finish mating the blue cable to provide backup power to the Canada Arm 2. And Anne, one quick recommendation. We recommend that you go in head first. Okay, I tried that a few times. Uh, copy. There's a bracket hanging out from the diagonal. There's a couple of brackets hanging out from the diagonal that are uh, catching. Copy. And, and we have an alternate route for you to get into the truss if you like. Okay, I'll try this again. McLean is currently in the S0 truss, Bay 00, where she will demate one connector before mating another two. She'll then give Mission Control the go to power up the 4B channel if everything looks good. I'm out of the truck today. I wondered if that was going to happen. Copy that, Ann. Great job. I'm checking my safer handles. Great job. And stand by for safer handles. Copy, Ann. And we'll uh, take a glove and half check when you're done with that.
Anne McLean has now arrived back to the hatch on the Quest airlock. Just as a reminder, uh, recall that you connected dotted safety tether to the aft D ring, airlock D ring. So when you release, be sure to release his and not yours. Thank you. When the astronauts are both in the uh, Quest airlock, there will be a series of equipment checks, and the spacewalk clock will stop once the astronauts have closed the hatch and airlock repressurization has begun. We see you uh, ingressing the airlock, and don't forget to um, grab the thermal cover.